Okay, this is David from TheUnlocker.com. We're going to show you how to load a custom ROM on your T-Mobile G1 after you have rooted it. Um, if you don't know what rooted is or you haven't rooted your phone yet, you need to do so. So go to our site, it's about there, TheUnlocker.com, um, and look for the How to Root video. Do that whole procedure first, then move on to this video, um, which you can find on our site by looking for how to load custom ROMs. Once you get to that step, you're going to go scroll down to the first step of how to load a custom ROM. And there's two developers that we have listed on here. Um, for more developers, you can go to xdadevelopers.com and look for their stuff. But uh, for this video, we're just going to show you we're going to load uh, the Dude of Life. So you're going to click here for his latest ROMs. Okay. And this should load his page. You'll see here current builds. Click on that and save that file to the computer. Okay, next we're going to plug in our G1 to the computer. Just like that, click mount. Okay, next we're going to take Okay, next we're going to take the ROM that we downloaded from the dudes, and we are going to save it to the top folder of our SD card. Okay, once we've done that, we're going to see if we have an update.zip file, we're going to delete it. Then we're going to rename the new ROM we just downloaded to update. And now we can close this out. Okay, now we're going to unplug the G1. And turn it off. Okay, we're going to turn it back on holding the end button and the home button at the same time. Don't let go. Once you see the exclamation point, we're going to open it up. We're going to hit Alt L to show us the text. We're going to hit Alt W to wipe the phone. Then Alt S to apply the new ROM. Okay, once it's done, we're going to hit Home and Back. And let go to restart the phone. Okay, now you're going to go through your normal setup process. Okay, after you load your ROM, uh, you're going to want to load a radio to get things like Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and uh, even like general just uh, basic phone functions to work. So we're going to plug the G1 into the computer. Pull it down. I'm going to tap that and hit mount. Then we're going to go back to our site to the same post. Now, under how to load a custom radio, you're going to download the latest radio from the link there and save it to your computer. And we're going to take the latest radio from the computer and we're going to save it to the root folder of our SD card, which is the topmost folder. And we're going to delete any update.zips that are already on the card. And rename the radio to update. And then we can close this out. Okay, then we're going to unplug the G1 from the computer and turn it off. Okay, we're going to hold down the end and the home button. Just turn the phone back on. Keep holding it down. To 
So we get to the exclamation screen. Slide the phone out. Alt L to bring up the menu. We're going to just do Alt S. Okay, once it's done, home and back to reboot. Phone should turn back on. Now once you get back to the home screen, you're all set.